Yeah, no, it's going really good. Um, obviously, with uh, the contingent over in in the World Cup, it's um, we've got a lot of, a chance to work with a lot of the younger kids in the bottom end of the squad, um, which has been great. We've just been working on skill development and getting them used to having a footy in their hands again. Um, and then we had a lot more one-on-one skill-based stuff, um, more just getting them hands used to getting their hands on the footy again, getting them used to touching the footy. A um, little bit of defensive work here and there, a little bit more broken down structure type of stuff. Um, and then of course uh, the strength and conditioning department's been um, getting their hands on them and obviously getting them fitter and getting them a bit stronger and good chance for the players to get work hard at that part of their games um, leading up until um, obviously next January when we'll have a full our full um, numbers back with all our international players. One of the things that uh, surprised some of our uh, supporters this week was how early, how early the lads actually had hold of the, the ball. You know, in, in past years, and I've been here ten years. You know, lads have been running up hills this time of year and doing a lot of conditioning. Is that something that's uh, a little bit different? Yeah, look, we wanted to put a focus. We can't do a lot of team stuff at the moment. Obviously, we just don't have the numbers to do uh, the teamwork at the moment. So we want to put more of a focus on making sure that the players, um, we could improve their skill and their little bits and bobs um, to their games, so, um, their little elements and individually which they can improve on. Um, and we're already starting to see the benefits of that, obviously, and we've been doing some some um, some faster teamwork and the players obviously have the ball in their hands a lot more which means the pass are a little bit crisper and I suppose the other part of it is you know we want to get the players used to having a wet and muddy type of ball heading into the first part of the season um, and the other really big positive is a lot of the younger players get a lot more teamwork now obviously with the senior players some of them being away with World Cup duties so it's been great yeah look having the ball in their hands is really important and uh, traditionally this part of the season is used to you know, run them up hills and get them flogged. So, as you said, yeah, it's it's great to get the players to get their ball on the hand, their hands on the balls and get their skills up and get them moving into the the crucial part of the season. Adam Swift earlier in the week said that uh, you have been flogging the lads, though. So, what sort of things you've been doing with the, that kind of conditioning side? Yeah, the, it's been a little bit. Uh, you know, like obviously not my department firsthand, but obviously Matty Daniels is the head strength conditioner. He's he's been slowly building them into it. Um, this, there hasn't been a uh, a week one where they just got here and we just ran them off their legs. It's been a slow build. Um, the players have responded really well. And again, you don't want to. We don't want to push them too hard where we break them and they can't train. We want to make sure we've got a lot of players out there training. So it's a, it's just a case of building a foundation, making sure they're getting fitter week by week, day by day. Yeah. So what's uh, what's the plan for next week? Um, so again, we'll do very similar to what we did this week, um, except we'll probably just add an extra ten or fifteen minutes onto the end of the sessions or. Or what we do within the session might be a little bit harder just to lift the intensity of the session up slightly. Um, obviously in the weight room, Matty will, Matty will lift the, um, the intensity of the weights or the, the weight of the weights and get a little bit heavier. Um, the running sessions you know, may go a little bit longer or a little bit shorter and a little bit faster depending on what um, Matty has for him. Um, but very similar to what we did this weekend, obviously we'll just look to do just a little bit more at the end of the sessions to tag on and uh, make sure we're doing our loads are increasing.